financial decisions by checking in with the signals your body is sending. In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. For the best financial therapy advice, news, and updates, be sure to click on that subscribe button so you're notified anytime I post a new video. Sensory motor therapy helps people take notice of their bodies and the signals that their body is sending them. This type of therapy is often used when a person is stuck in traditional talk therapy or can't formulate the exact words to get across what exactly is going on. So sensory motor therapy can be helpful in a ton of settings. Originally it was used to help treat trauma patients, but now we use it for depression, anxiety, and attachment concerns. And today I'm going to show you how to use that checking in technique to help you with your money. So how do we use this type of therapy with your finances? Doing a quick check-in with your body can help you make sure you're spending and saving and align with what feels good for you. When our body is physically anxious, it's in that fight, flight, or free state, it's really hard to make rational decisions. So this is that panic order at a restaurant when the menu is 100 plus items long. So we're all familiar with that. When we're in that panic state, we can't check into our wise, rational self. So one of the techniques we use in sensory motor therapy is called grounding. And all that is, is taking a second to get grounded and to be present. Because when we're in that fight, flight, freeze, we really can't think rationally. So one way to quiet that down is to physically bring down the nervous system. A great way to do that is by using the 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 grounding technique. So with this 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 grounding technique, all we're going to do is check in with the five senses by running through each of those things. So wherever you are, take note of five things you can see around you. And I really actually want you to look around and name them either aloud or in your head. So let me do it with you. Five things I can see right now. Um, lamp, plant, pillow, couch, and blanket. Four things you can touch. So feeling your hair, maybe feeling jewelry, feeling the sensation of clothing on your body, feeling your body on the chair or on the couch. So checking in with four things you can touch. Three things you can hear. So maybe the clock ticking, footsteps in the hallway, maybe the air conditioner blowing. Two things you can smell. So it could be maybe an aroma in the air, or maybe you have lotion or perfume on your body that you can smell. And then one thing you can taste. So maybe toothpaste or coffee. That's it. So running through those five senses helps to distract you from that anxious thought and bring you back to the here and now so you can make rational decisions. So let's say you are clothing shopping and you're walking from the dressing room to check out and you can feel some of that panic or anxiety come up. You run yourself through that five, four, three, two, one, and then you go, oh yeah, my body's probably panicking right now because I had one thing on my shopping list. I was gonna buy one sweater and now I have an armful of clothes. By practicing this, by checking in with your body, you're better able to make that rational decision so that when you get up to cash out, you can say, actually, I don't want 99% of these clothes, I just want this one sweater. So if you're gonna use it, please let me know how you will use this to help with your money. I have a free 54321 handout so you can practice the sensory motor check-in anytime. How are you going to use this therapy technique to help with your money? Let me know in the comments below. And while you're there, don't forget to click on subscribe. Again, this video is a part of my Ask a Therapist series, so be sure to check out the other videos in this series if you found this helpful. All right, see ya.